Hey Aquarius, Everlong Mystic here. Today we are going to get you just a general message. We're just going to see what you what you need to know about right now. I'm just kind of leaving it open. And we're going to start with Lenormand just to see what, kind of narrow it down to what we're talking about here. Alright, for Aquarius. All right, so we have the house. So we're looking at we're looking at domestic affairs here, Aquarius. So what about what about home? What about home for Aquarius? There's trouble. Dang it. All right. So we have snake, and snake is just an indication of some kind of trouble. Could be big, could be small, but snake is just a trouble. So we have some domestic trouble, trouble at home. All right, so let's let's see what this is about. Now, I did randomly pick an oracle deck for you, Aquarius, and for some reason, the universe wants you to get a message from my Knight of the Living Dead trading card deck. All right, so you're gonna get a scene from Night of the Living Dead. I have not used this on my channel before, but ooh, what do you got? Okay, so oh, this is the very beginning of the movie. Pursued, very beginning of the movie in the cemetery, where they see their first zombie, and he starts chasing the woman. So. And I really don't like, I really don't like this paired with the house and the snake because it makes me, gosh Aquarius, it makes me feel like there's somebody at home that, to say it gently, does not have your best interest in mind. So, hmm. I don't like giving, I mean, I don't like giving fear, you know, I don't, I don't like giving fear as a message. So we're just gonna see, we're just gonna see what, what this is. Because it may not be like, oh my god, somebody's after you. It could be something like, you know, being pursued. Like someone's pursuing you, it, like in a positive way, so we don't, we don't know yet. I'm not necessarily gonna sugarcoat, but we're just gonna see what comes out, okay? Oh, Ten of Cups. That's nice. I like that. Okay, so Ten of Cups. Two of Wands. And Three of Wands. Okay. So first off, the Two of Wands and Three of Wands. Very cool because that is, you know, that is a natural progression. So there is, you know, like... When you're going up in numbers, it's a positive thing, so that's good. Here in this Two of Wands, I, I really feel like, I know there's a lot of crows. I mean, this is the Murder of Crows deck, and there's a, there's a crow in every card. But just with the fact that we have on this Ten of Cups this huge crow in the sky... Like, it it makes me feel like this is spirit, okay? It's like spirit looking out for your happiness, because the Ten of Cups is, you know, that, that happy, happy. But we have the Two of Wands here, and it's like, it's like you're being shown a direction. You're being shown a direction to go. It's like whatever whatever this trouble at home is it, it's you, there are there are signs pointing as to what either what you need to do or where you need to go in with the situation like if you're like if you have options or if you've thought about whatever this trouble is and you're like man I should well it's like I could do this or I could do this but I'm not sure which one you are getting guidance towards your happiness the what the best thing for you Aquarius, 
spirit is helping, okay? Because look, you've got the two of wands here, and it's like this is you with the two choices, right? You've got spirit right here telling you, hey, this is the right direction to go in. And then not only that, spirit flies away showing you the direction like literally this way you know what i mean it's like i feel like you are being guided through whatever this trouble is and just like with this pursued card it's like you might feel like man the the world the world is out to get me things aren't going in my favor you know what i mean but i there this is such a relief right here just to see this All right, what else does Aquarius need to know? Well, looky here, we have the Knight of Cups. <laughs> He's offering you a tasty beverage. This feels like a finish line of some sort because he's he's not moving. He's kind of stationary. It almost looks like he is, he's looking at you. He's waiting for you. There's something waiting for you, Aquarius. And it's, and it's this way. It's in the way, wh whatever direction spirit is leading you, that there's something here for you. It's like he's holding this cup and it's like he's waiting to give you this cup, whoever this is. All right, what else for Aquarius? Oh, this is about your choices. So we have the Seven of Cups here, and look, I swear, this is like, this is like Spirit having a sit down, like, they're like, Aquarius, sit down, we need to talk. <laughs> Aquarius, sit down, we need to talk. I'm gonna tell you something and you're gonna listen. All right? It's like, it's like you're sitting there, you're, you're seeing whatever these <laughs> signs are, you're getting these messages, you're, you know that spirit is doing something, right? And I, don't, I mean, you may be aware that spirit is guiding you towards whatever this is. You may not be, but... The thing, the thing with this card is it's like there's like this tattoo on this guy or whatever this is on his back. It's like it's it's this dark, it's it's darkness, it's shadow, it's negativity, it's strife, it's you know those dense things that just uh bring you down and make it, it makes it hard for you to fly, right? It's like you're you're like at times you're covered with this and it's like spirit is having a sit down with you saying, "Hey man, you really just please follow my lead. I'm going to show you. You know, it's like, it's like you're being asked to trust, Aquarius. It's, this is a lesson in trust. It's a lesson in trust. All right, let's see if there's anything else. What else does Aquarius need to know? Nine of Pentacles, very cool. Okay, so we have Nine of Pentacles here, and this this is success. I mean, this is you seeing the results. It's like it's almost like that is what like this spirit is trying to show you. He's like, sit down, we're gonna have a talk, and I'm going to tell you about how this is gonna work out for you. But all, all you have to do is listen and trust, Aquarius. You just have to listen and trust for things to work out. And even the, the figure on this Nine of Pentacles, she's, she's been around the block. 
She knows. She knows how much work goes into the Nine of Pentacles. She knows that it gets tough at times. You know, she knows about the darkness that, that we carry sometimes. But she's with spirit. And she has she has creations to show for, for all the work that she's done. And she wears, you know, she wears her pentacles proudly. And that's, that's what spirit wants for you. You just have to follow, trust. All right. Um, I will actually want to pull just a clarifier on this Knight of Cups because I want to see what's waiting for you. Because it's like there's something coming for you. Not something coming for you. Ha, <laughs> pursued, that's funny. There's something waiting for you, and they have something for you. And Spirit's trying to explain. It's it's something like this, right? The Nine of Pentacles. But I just want to know a little bit more about this kind of like finish line type thing, just because I'm curious. So what is this... What is this finish line? Like where where Aquarius is headed? What is it what does it have to do with or anything really? Oh, how nice is this? Justice. And it's the justice with all the colors. These are all the colors of the rainbow that is normally in the Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups is like usually has a, a rainbow somewhere, right? Justice. So you're going to be offered a cup of justice, Aquarius. So whatever, whatever is going on, whatever this trouble is, this domestic trouble, this trouble at home, there, there is, there, there will be justice to the situation. As long as you trust, I mean, as long as you trust, this is, this is good. All right, Aquarius, this is your message. I hope it helped you in some way. I thank you for embracing your inner mystic and I'll see you next time. Bye, Aquarius.